Hey guys, just got off work, got some packages I want to open for you, so hopefully this isn't too quiet, but uh, I'm going to open this one first. Maybe. <clears throat> okay. Now, I don't know if this is going to work exactly what I want, how I want it to, but this is a high sec uh, security strike. Um, so where the door latches, this one has four screws that can be put into it. So um, you can put longer screws. Make it harder to break the door through, basically. Now, I've <clears throat> got two of these. And I know what all this is going to be, but let's go ahead and open this. Okay. Alright, now here is the other part that would go onto the door. The other part would go onto the wall, basically, or the door frame. This goes onto the door. Uh, so I'm going to see about getting those installed soon. And a Blink XT2 indoor outdoor waterproof security camera. Now I ordered two of these, <clears throat> so this other package should be the other one. Yes. And also screws. I didn't know those latches were going to come with screws. I got some long screws here. XT2. Okay, so I guess they came in different packages. I'm not really sure why. This is the add-on camera. So what's the difference between these packages? Well, they're both wrapped in plastic, so let's find out. Looks like this is going to slide up there. Actually, it's facing the other way. There we go. Some booklets in there. I think I'm going to have an idea of how to attach it. It's a, like a charging. Okay, there's some instructions on the back of that. That's the camera. Oops, this came with screws also and batteries. So I wasn't sure if it was going to come with batteries really. Uh, here's the mount. Another piece here. Screws, batteries. So I'm just gonna have to figure out how to put this together. Okay. Here is. I guess that this this came with um, since it's gonna be wireless. I guess this is like a little router type thing for it. Okay. I understand now why this came in a different box. Okay, so <clears throat> I'm assuming the other camera is pretty much going to be the same, opening that up, so I'll do that off camera. But I also want to open this up because since I'm going to have to screw these in, I got this today <clears throat> from Walmart. Hyper tough 20 volt uh, drill that comes with other tools. There, hammer wrench and stuff. Um, so this was like $40. Um, I was originally talking to my landlord about borrowing his screw, um, his power drill and he said that I could and then my neighbor said he had a power drill and then I was asking my neighbor you know when can we when's a good time for you and, and then he told me his power drill was like in his car that was in another town that's broke down and he needs to get it towed and, and I'm like man I'm like, you know what, I really just need to get some tools myself. So I went into Walmart to see how cheap they were. I was surprised at how cheap power drills are, because they had one for like $20. But um, I know these things are cheap, and they're not really meant to last. But, you know, 
I was like, I don't know if I want to get the cheapest one. And then there was another, the, ne the next highest one up was 30 and that's the one that's in here. And then this set was 40 and it came with all this stuff. So I knew if I got the drill, I was going to have to get the bit that I wanted. And, um, so I figured just getting this would just solve a lot of problems and I'd have a lot of options just from this. And I have a toolbox that I've had for a while and, um, I don't have a lot of tools, really. <laughs> so, at least this is a little bit something more for me to put in there. I did have a tape measure, that's about, and I had screwdrivers, but this also this comes, comes with a pouch. It's got a box there. Comes with a pouch, but I'm going to be putting the stuff in my toolbox, but it's cool. I don't know what this is. This must be the charger. So that's what I'm gonna have to do. To I'm gonna have to charge the power drill to screw in these security cameras after I get them all connected to the app and everything. <clears throat> and then I, I'm also, I mean, I was gonna need the power drill for the security cameras and for the door for the hinges and and those other things I already know that I can use it for also. So. I think it's not going to be a bad deal. <clears throat> Here's that. What's with all those? For $40, I mean, they might be really cheap and junk, but <laughs> I'm sure that it'll work for the things that I need to use it for. I'm not looking to start a construction company with this or anything, you know? Basically, right now, I just need to get the power drill out. <clears throat> so, there's that. Yeah, somebody said it was kind of made for small hands, like... This feels alright. So, let's see, how do we slide this charger on? And there's an extra bit back there, a storage thing for the bit, I guess. Battery. Hmm. So looks like that's how it's gonna charge. <clears throat> Hopefully, that's right. It's not gonna fry it when I turn it on or something. Plug it in. Power on, battery charging. I should have checked to see if it already had a charge, but... For some reason, I don't think so. I don't know if there's a... Oh, it seems like it does. Okay, well, I might have to wait for that then. Okay. Should be all right. All right, well. All right, guys, sorry. Weird video, but I got to wake up early, too, and then go get the vehicle to get two new tires put on. So, and then later in the day work. So, but I'm glad to get all this stuff now. I'm going to try to get it all figured out now, except, at least except for the door part, but all right. So that's it guys. God bless.